The more experienced Subnautica player would note that, yes, I'm not making a vehicle and that I won't be making one anytime soon because I don't have the right blueprint for that. If we bring these bad boys up, somewhere in here would be a blueprint for a mobile vehicle bay. I don't see that. So, nope, we're not making a, a vehicle today. Even though we do have the blueprints to make a vehicle. Hey, okay, I see. We're going over to the kelp forest. One of many kelp forests because, yeah, we're going to be looking for the blueprints so we can make one of those bays. And I see something floating around over there. We'll hope that is one of the blueprint pieces I'm looking for and not a sea moth. Ooh, solar panel fragment. That sounds exciting. We'll go ahead and scan that bad boy. Cat's excited. Look at her. She's terribly excited. She can hardly contain her excitement. What is that down there? That looks like something. I don't know what you are. A crashed life pod. Ah, that's interesting. I had not noticed this guy before. I also realized in the course of... Well, realizing that I can't do anything that I would like to do. And I, I can't go in there. Oh, that's kind of a bummer. That, yeah, I know. I, I kind of missed scanning the desk. I don't think I quite got it, and I could have scanned the desk so that I could build a desk by way of getting a desk blueprint. Ah, oh, that's how we get in there. But there's really not anything in here of consequence, it looks like. Which is kind of a shame. Bye, cat. Not even a, a life support kit, life Warning, repair kit, something. Ah, I see you, buddy. Don't even think about it. Ah, man, we got to get up to the top here. Problem is, I need to spend a bunch of time at the bottom, I think in the various kelp forests, looking for blueprint pieces so we can build that vehicle base so we can turn around and build a vehicle. Emergency. That's kind of like, I don't know, that's my goal at this point. I have no idea how long the series is going to go. Probably should have said that long ago, but whatever. I don't know how long the series is going to go. I don't know if it'll turn into a long-running one like I have with Ark or with Seven Days to Die. Maybe, maybe not. I really don't know, but come on. Oh, those bubbles aren't going to make it to me. Bummer. Whatever. I did see... I thought I saw. Maybe I didn't. Okay, I guess not. I thought I saw something right there, but oh well, whatever. I did not. I see some more salvage or something. Yeah, I don't really want any metal salvage right now. I'm trying to keep my inventory free. Not for anything in particular, because really I'm looking to get blueprints more than anything else, but, you know, just the same. You were probably salvage too, aren't you? Yep. Where are you going? I don't know if you can hear her in the background. That'd be alternate recording cat. Ooh, what are you? Hmm. Sure, we'll take an egg. Probably not a good idea. It's the second one I've picked up. And there's a... Give me some air. There we go. There's some air bubbles. Alright, let's just chill for a second right here. I see something else down there at the bottom. And I'm holding my knife out because those stalkers are jerks. Alright, let's get down to the bottom. I'm gonna hope that that is a mobile vehicle. Eh, bioreactor fragment. Whatever. That's cool. I'm really not... I don't know, I mean... Ah, look at that. Unlock the bioreactor blueprint. I don't know what I would do with it right now, because I don't really think I can... I don't really have the stuff to make a base or anything, I don't, I don't think. What happens if I scan it again? Oh, I get titanium for it. Well, that's kind of cool, I guess. Alright, we need to get up top, because I am running out of O2... I'm just trying to see if anything else pops out of me as we're climbing. I see an ore piece. We can go check that, assuming I don't lose it on the way back down, which is entirely possible. All right, let's get some air. I might have to spend a bunch of time just swimming around looking for blueprint pieces because we're not going to be able to do a whole lot without them, as best I can tell. I mean, we kind of need that stuff. 
silver ore. Ooh, I have been looking for silver ore, so apparently that was a really lucky roll or something there. Because I, I have not seen any of that. Oh, there we go. Mobile vehicle bay fragment. All right. So we need two more of those. I'm going to hope that's one right there and that the other one. Nope. I guess we'll grab it just for the free titanium. Mobile vehicle bay fragment. Okay. That's two out of three. We're getting there. So I'm, I need to look around in this area is my guess. Since it sure does seem like things are kind of stacked a little bit. Wow, she is really just meowing up a storm. Grabbing some air. Grabbing some air. This is one of those instances where maybe I should have a couple of extra tanks when I know I'm going to be going on deep dives. I can just grab a couple extra ones just to, you know, save a little time so we're not constantly going up for air. And I know I didn't need to go up right away and I might have been able to swim around for a while and actually find another brain coral just to kind of replenish air, but uh, it's all right. You would be a biter. Oh, well, can I scan you? Do you want to fight? Hmm, not anymore. All right, whatever. It's cool. You go on your way. I'll go on mine because I'm on a mission to find mobile vehicle bay fragments. What are you? There we go. I'm going to ignore that because that is a stalker and it's just... Oh, or a biter. <laughs> I was going to say that's a stalker. It's just going to bite and run. Or not. Whoa, what in the heck is that? It can move stuff? Oh, wow. Oh, you jerk. All right, you want to go? Let's go. Come on. We can do this. Apparently, I'm just going to harvest a bunch of creep vines instead of actually hit the stupid biter. All right, whatever. It's cool. It's cool, man. You run away. I won't chase you down or something. Pretty sure we have the rest of the parts we're going to need, I, I kind of think. What's our space look like? Let's go to inventory. I kind of feel like I should maybe grab some, just a couple more seeds while I can. Just a second here. There we go. Grab some oxygen. Let's grab a couple more seeds just because I don't always get out this way. And uh, when I do, I feel like I should grab a couple. Cat's chilling. She had run off and she's returned. All right, let's go build ourselves a mobile vehicle bay because I think we can actually do it now. Pretty sure, pretty sure we can do it. Pretty sure, not 100%, but pretty sure. Is there anything over here? I don't know, I just feel like maybe I'm missing something. Have I already scanned you? I guess I have. Couldn't remember. I don't remember what those things are called though. Nighttime approaches. I suppose you could just rephrase that and say night approaches, because, you know, that kind of implies a time just by saying night, but, you know, whatever. Minor details. Gonna need some more food, going to need some more water. Do I have any inventory? Yep. I have quite a bit, actually. All right. I'm just kind of looking around for some fish to grab. Maybe grabbing peeper over here. Those were pretty good. Those were good eats. Ah. Too fast for me. Alright. Come out. Come on. What about you? Click, click, clickety click. There we go. Got a peeper. Alright. Where are the air bladders? Air sacks. Let's grab an air sack. I don't want to use my bleach just yet. Alright. I'm not going to be able to grab that guy. That's okay though. We do have a big bottle of water on hand, so we can drink that. It's okay. And yeah, I realize that means I'm then going to have to use some bleach, but whatever. Don't point out my inconsistencies. It's very rude. All right. Inventory secured. Open up the fabricator. Sustenance. Ow. That would be the cat jumping out rather painfully for me. I think she's going after the other one. Let's make some water. All right, before we do anything else, let's go ahead and eat and drink. We need to 
take care of that stuff. Uh, disinfected water. Let's go with the filtered water. That'll be fine for now. And then, since we have this guy ready, I need to switch some stuff out. That's what I need to do. Okay, so before we do that, let's just make some more silicone rubber. That's just going to free up some inventory slots. Go into the escape pod, and I need, I think, that one. There we go. Yeah, that, I think, has everything we're going to need in it. I'm... Hmm. Now, we're still going to need some stuff. I take that back. Mobile vehicle bay. We need a titanium ingot and a power cell, so... We're going to need to craft a power cell, which means we're going to need more batteries, which means I'm going to need more copper ore, which... I think I know where to find that. Assuming it regenerates, which I'm not really sure about. Okay, let's grab a titanium ingot. Wrong button. I just want to hit escape all the time. Deployables! Mobile vehicle bay! Look at that. Let's see if we can actually build... Ah, oh, crud, it's too big, isn't it? Alright, I know. It's big. I gotta... I gotta free up some inventory space. Um, put the lubricant in there. Oh! There we go. That was all we needed. And, um... Hmm, I kind of feel like we should make some fiber or something. So let's go ahead and... Fiber it up. Fiber mesh. And one more fiber mesh. I don't know where we're gonna put this vehicle bay. Let's go pop into the water and let's see where... Release vehicle bay! It's kind of like the Kraken. Release the vehicle bay, Kraken! Right there. We'll put it right there. That looks good. That's good. It's a good spot for it. I'm going to say it's a good spot for it. Are you ready to go? Oh, look at that. That's kind of cool. Vehicles. Seamoth, so going to need an ingot, a power cell, some glass, and some lubricant. So that means, like I said, we're going to need some more copper ore. I have run out of copper ore entirely. So, let's see, I'm already turned around. So let's go back this direction. Since it seemed like there were a lot of limestone... Is that what it is? Limestone over here and sandstone over in the kelp forest? Maybe that's why I found silver? Ah, oh, that very well could be the case. There were a lot of little um, outcroppings over here and kind of hopeful that they regenerate over time. Maybe they do, maybe they don't. There's a limestone chunk. Yeah, that was definitely sandstone. Copper, come back, I need you. So there we go. That answered my question of how do I find silver then? I need to go find some sandstone chunks and then maybe I'll find different materials. So that's one copper. It's one copper. You'll never catch me, copper. Hmm. There's another sandstone chunk right there. Limestone chunk. Check you. Check this chunk out. Titanium, you are a disappointing chunk. I hope you understand, but you are a disappointment to me. Just trying to see. It's a little hard to tell when it's super dark over here. There we go. A little more color. That'll help me out. Thank you very much. Looks like the sun is coming up. Not seeing it much... On these guys here. Seemed like... Oh, there we go. There's one. Almost went right by. There we go. Perfect. So that's going to be enough. That's good. That's enough. So we need to grab four mushrooms. So let's grab four mushrooms. So... Eins, zwei, drei, vier. And let's go grab some air, because uh, we're running low. All right, we can dive. We don't need the rest of that. It's fine. Well, we ended up getting full oxygen anyway, so it does not matter. All right, escape pod. We need the fabricator. We're going to make some batteries. And then we might need to make some glass here. Or, no, we have some glass in uh, the boxy majigger, so we're going to check that guy. All right, so we got power cell. Let's grab some glass. Did we need two glass, and then we need a lubricant, and we need an ingot. And I think that was what we needed. Okay, so where's our mobile vehicle bay? The MVB. Let's go check out the MVB. All right, mobile vehicle bay, left click. Boom! We're making a SEMA. Well, we didn't exactly start the episode with it, but by golly, we're ending the episode with it. Although we're going to have a minute to float around too, so that's cool because I'm actually really excited to try this thing out. How does it work? Can I just... Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh. 
I like E. Can I, can I put guns on it or anything? Oh, that'd be awesome. It looks like it moves pretty quickly. Now, do I need to recharge it in some way, shape, or form? That I don't know. Yeah, this thing moves around pretty quickly. Look at that. We are getting around. I'm liking this. And even better, I don't need to worry about getting oxygen while I'm in here. This thing's just cruising. Look at this. Wow. Can I can I swim through this stuff? Okay. There's no there's no collision on that. That's good to know. Wow. Yeah, this is cool. This is cool. This is good stuff. What are you down there? Quartz. Did someone bite me or am I just running out of energy? I guess I'm just running out of energy. So I don't know what that means just yet. I'm going to have to figure this out. Does that mean... Oh! Watch where you're going there, buddy. Talking to myself, because that's some crazy drunken driving right there. That looked pretty bad. I don't know. Do I need to, like, put energy cells in here to replenish it? Is there anything I need to do? I don't... I don't quite know just yet. So if I just pop out... I'm just going to give it a second here. Let's see if it has auto-regeneration capabilities like the escape pod does. So if it does, that's kind of cool. I mean, I'm not against having to collect stuff to make fuel for it. Fuel cells, batteries, whatever, something like that. I'm not opposed to that. I just, I don't, I don't quite know how this vehicle works yet. So, um, maybe I need to just make a new one. Maybe they're disposable. I hope not. That'd be kind of a shame. Can I pick anything up or interact when I'm in here? Nope, but I can definitely bang it around and damage it. That's good to know. That's good to know. So can I repair it? I bet if I had a welder or something along those lines, I could repair it. But I don't! So I guess I won't be repairing it anytime soon. That's okay, though. I just need to figure out where to find some more ore now. And maybe find some crash powder, which I, I don't think that's going to be easy to find. I'm still not entirely sure what killed me. I don't know if it was a crash or one of the other nasty things, but something definitely killed me. And uh, I don't know what it was, but we'll have to worry about that another time because I apparently need to play around with this thing a little bit and figure out how it works. But anyway, we're going to call that one an episode right there. Like I said, we didn't start with a vehicle. But we ended with one, and I'm spinning a cat around in case you're wondering what I'm doing. Why I'm just sitting there floating instead of actually doing something useful. I was doing something useful, you just didn't see it because now you just see this. Oh, look, she's just so cute and not doing anything. Yeah, that's not what was going on. But not your problem, mine. We'll catch up on the next one. Till then, thanks for watching. See you later.